Hello everybody and thanks for joining us for another Whitfield's Food Review. Today we are at KFC trying what they, every site I saw said it's first time in the United States or something like that. The KFC Zinger. I don't even know what a chicken zinger is. Is it just like a chicken sandwich? There's a little, maybe a little peppery? I have no idea. But I could have swore a zinger was out before. I guess where I used to eat them, but I guess not. <laughs> maybe they're little ones or something? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. So here's the sandwich itself. It's a good size. Um, it does look like there's a red tint to it, so it might mm -hmm. be spicy. And we got some finger licking sauce. She didn't want to order it. Sounds stupid. And what if they didn't have it? And they looked real dumb. I want finger licking. <laughs> Bad. So, okay, let's go right into it. It's red. Look at it. Huh. It's spicy? Look, there's actually like an orangey tint yeah. to the inside of it. It actually is a little spicy. It takes a minute. Okay. Mmm. That's a good size sandwich. Pretty big. Oh yeah. Mm. I get this spice now. Take a minute. It's reminiscent of, of the level of heat to maybe like a um, a Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich. It's got like a Frank's, you know, red hot sauce yeah. kind of quality to it. Yeah, there's a little kick in the back of the throat. It's pretty simple, a little sandwich. It's just lettuce, mayo, and chicken. There's not a lot of accoutrements on here, but honestly, I don't think it needs it. The spice is kind of the selling point. And considering the size of this and the stuff that you get with it, this sandwich is only like two bucks. Four things are five bucks. I mean, you're, this is essentially a $2 sandwich, which is much bigger than a $2 sandwich. A hearty little sandwich with a nice kick. If you don't like spicy at all, you might have a little trouble with this. It's got a little, like I said, it's got like a hot sauce burn to it, but also has a pepper back end. You know, like cayenne or even just a lot of black pepper will kind of get you back here, opposed to like burning your whole throat. It gets the back of your mouth. It kind of does a little bit of both of that. Sesame seed bun, a little bit of lettuce, a little bit of mayo. Keep it, keep it nice and moist. Good. Good little sandwich. I think KFC, you, you done did good. This, the Colonel's back on his game. No, actually the KFC gold, he was back on his game. That was, that was so good. Very good. Um, so, I don't know. I mean, here's the deal. With this, I like the sandwich a lot. In fact, I think this is one of their better chicken sandwiches I've ever had here because I like that little spice. And it's a big one. Burger King, I'm looking at you. We're new king of chicken sandwiches. I'm sorry. I think this is better than the, the new Burger King chicken sandwich all day. You think this is better than that? Mm -hmm. All day, any day. Sorry, Burger King. KFC still got you beat. When you include value, when you include value, what is five that? out of five because it's five dollar pillow. I don't know if it's new. They said it's new. I don't know. KFC's sort of maybe new. Five dollar Philip with the chicken zinger gets a five out of five. As she said, now the Colonel won't try to come kick my ass. I actually <laughs> really like this one. He won't be mad at me like he has in some of the other videos. This is a good stuff, KFC. We highly recommend you guys go out and try this. You gonna try this? I don't know. Let us know in the comments below. Is the zinger new? Because we both feel like we've heard this before. Maybe it's new in this incarnation. I don't know. Let us know in the comments below what you think, what you thought of what we did here, and all the words and comments and notifications and likes and shares and stuff. And all that other good stuff. So, and as always, until next time.